Next question, I'm gonna start with AJ. Straight out of Compton, the movie. Discuss. Now, what is the impact of NWA's continuing commercial success on our hip hop scene and our hip hop culture? Personally, I haven't seen the movie yet. I'm a big NWA fan, or I was back in the day anyway, so I haven't seen the film. But for me, when they come about around the time Public Enemy, I think they came after Public Enemy, it's rebellious, rebellious. And I think, you know, there's a lot of problems going on in LA at the time, you know, a lot of black, black people getting, getting hurt by the police, you know, the, the, the system, the law over there was, was problematic. And I think that's what NWA represented, man. You know, they, they, they wanted to speak for, for, for the youth at the time, you know? So for me, they were inspirational. They were rebellious, they were hardcore, and they, didn't, they just didn't care. They made what they wanted to make. Okay, Talib, as, as, as a, um, a conscious rapper within the scene, who a lot of people look to, what would you say is uh, NWA's impact on the scene at the moment? Oh, NWA is legendary and revolutionary and one of the greatest music groups of all time. Forget hip hop. You gotta understand what NWA gave to the game, they gave it in one year. They gave you that, that, that straight out of Compton album and that easy easy album and that DOC album all within a year or two. NWA captures in a microcosm the pathologies of the problems of oppressed people um, in their personal lives and in their music. You see things happening with Dr. Dre and Ice Cube and Easy in their personal lives that you understand why they made the music they made. I saw the movie in Dr. Dre's house with Dr. Dre, you know, with him whispering in my ear certain scenes about things that were happening in the movie. And me and Dr. Dre that day, we was making music and it was very tense and aggressive and I was a little, I was a little put off because it was a strange environment for me making music with him that day. But then I saw the movie with him that night and I saw a Hollywood representation of what his life is like. And if you listen to Dr. Dre in interviews, he says, we were trying to, we were trying to do our own version of Public Enemy, but we come from Compton. Like we were trying to do, we, I, I was trying to copy the Bomb Squad. Ice Cube was trying to write like Chuck D. We were trying to be Public Enemy. And um, you know, God bless them, man. God bless them for all their, all their fragility and all their flaws. They've given us such beautiful, beautiful art and the NWA family tree. When you talk about what that group represented on the West Coast, from them bringing out Snoop Dogg to Eminem to you know everything Ice Cube has done as an artist, it's just NWA is unquestion unquestionably hip hop. Indeed. Okay. Thank you.